happy Wednesday. Um, I just got out of clin I got out of clinical like two hours ago, and right now I'm studying for my pharmacology quiz that I have um, tonight at five. I have class from five to seven fifty, and she gives us like forty five minutes for quizzes. So right now, let me show you what I'm doing. I have like diuretics on the first page. ACE inhibitors and um, an ARB on the second page with a um, thrombolytic. So I basically, this is how I study for pharmacology. I tried flashcards and it doesn't work for me and I'm so glad I learned that quickly. Um, I have to go through the drugs that she puts on her blueprint. She gives us what drugs are gonna be on the quiz. I have to go through those drugs and just write everything down that I need to know for them and put them on blank sheets of paper. Because while I'm taking the quiz, like I'm really good with that, with visual learning. So when I'm taking the quiz and I see the name of the drug, for some reason that whole list pops up in my head and I can see the paper. Even if I don't close my eyes or anything, I just see the paper. So that worked really well on the first quiz. So I'm hoping it works on the second one. Um, I'm actually about to take a nap if I can if I can't fall asleep I'll just get up and start studying again but I really want to take a nap and then go get some Panera for lunch before I head to school I'm gonna head to school for three and class starts at five so I'm just gonna use that time to just keep getting the drugs in my head um, but I just wanted to touch in with you guys this was like the best clinical day I've had so far um, my patient today was so lovely. I really loved her. She, I had two patients today, but I focused in more on one than the other because the other one was being, um, DC'd. She's being discharged. So my other patient, um, I had to provide wound care for her. I, um, spiked and piggybacked an IV twice. Um, what else did I do? I gave an insulin injection right before I left and, um... It was just a really good day. Like my nurse was so helpful. She actually told me she wants to go back to school to um, teach pathophysiology. So that was really cool. Um, and she was telling me how she failed patho the first time she took it by 0 0.01 points. And that just goes to show you like look where she is now. Like we're, we're all going to make it. One day we're all going to be where we want to be. And it we just have to work for it. That's that's my philosophy. So I'm gonna try to do as much as I can tomorrow and Friday so that Saturday and Sunday I can just relax. So there is time to relax. You just have to time manage, guys. That's what we're doing. So let me do these diuretics and I will talk to you guys later. I'm late. I'm on my way to class. I have class at 10 and it's 9.46. So hopefully I have enough time to go downstairs, put my stuff in the fridge. Um, I have health assessment today and health assessment lab. And then at four, we're having a, sorry, I'm looking at the light. I drove up a little too far. Um, today we are having a get together with the second year um, CNL students. So that should be interesting. Hopefully it's fun, get some insight into what the program has to come. Last week went really good. Um, all the 500 exams that I had went really well. Um, I even ended up getting some extra points on some questions because my teach some of my professors threw certain questions out that weren't fair. So I really appreciated that on their part. Phew, excuse me. Very relaxing weekend. I literally just sat there and watch Netflix and did work here and there because I can't I can't not do work I have a problem like I can't not do work so I did a little work um, I did the paper the um, med math um, exam all that stuff that's due like tomorrow and Wednesday I did um, already because I don't like having a bunch of mum mumble jumble on my Mondays I just like starting the week fresh so today i really just have to concentrate on this week's content i don't like i don't like going into um a new week with old week's content trying to master that so this week um i just have to get things done for this week
So today I'm going apple picking and I'm really excited. I hope that um, I get some good apples. Today is actually, well, I don't know about the other locations, but today is actually the last day for this specific location for you to go. And you can go from nine to five. So it's about 1045-ish right now. So I'm hoping we can get there by like 1130, 1145. And yeah, I'm gonna pick some apples. That could be my one of my snacks for the week because um, you guys know I meal prep. So I'm hoping to get some real nice juicy apples. And then I'm more excited for the donut because I've heard um, really good things. And every time people go apple picking, they're always eating the donuts. And I'm just like, I never even knew this existed. Say hi. You good. What's up? How y'all doing? Nice. Thank, Thank you. you. This is a cheat sheet that shows you what we're picking today. Okay. Only picking the trees that have a ribbon attached to it. Okay. okay. Then when you come down I'm here, it's two twenty nine a pound. Okay. We ask that you only pick as much fruit as you are comfortable paying for. <laughs> in, in, in other words, yeah, in other words, don't, don't, don't try to be, don't try to be. <laughs> Don't, don't try to extend your picking awesome. experience. Yeah, exactly. okay, All the apples on the floor. Let's go. You this way. <laughs> you Let's go the other way. Yeah. Probably. I've never been apple picking. I don't know what the fuck to do. I'm about to pull out. First apple, y'all. There's a lot on these trees. So I can show you guys these trees. There's a lot on them. I forgot which kind this is. It's on the paper, but... These look like bear, bear, um, Bray Bird. Two think, apples and you need a rest. I need a rest with a view at. <laughs> oh, wow. This is so pretty. We go higher, we could probably see the vine yard. Yeah, vine yard. <laughs> That's vines over there, those grapes. Yeah. It's really fall, it's so pretty out here. Apple pickers in their natural habitat. Hey, this one? Oh no. I'm <laughs> <laughs> we didn't get one yet. Because none of them want to come down. Oh, this one's pretty. Let's see. This one's pretty. Go. We're gonna slingshot pumpkins. I feel like we have a better shot at the buckets than the bell. So if you hit the bell, or if you get one of them in there without it bouncing, then you get a prize of some sort. Oh, B, a B. Seven apples. Let me pull out some of them. I can't remember which one this was. I can't remember which was which, but they're really good. I'm so excited to eat them. Yum, yum, yum.